All right, here's perhaps another way we could uh, utilize the solar heat to run some kind of a machine that could convert to electricity. And that's use uh, black rocks. If you've ever walked across a beach that had black rocks on it and you got burned, you know how hot those black rocks can get. And then uh, differentiate on the bottom with uh, evaporative cooling to cool down the bottom part of the Stirling engine. But um, I just thought that was something I, I might want to mention was this um, idea of using um, black rocks that would absorb the heat. And uh, they hold that heat for a long time. They, they develop it over, over the day. And then uh, one of the camping things that I, I've heard about, I've never tried it, is to heat up a brick or rocks in the fireplace and put them in your sleeping bag to keep you warm at night. And this is kind of the same thing. Is that's a heat sink, um, heat storage device right there. And uh, that might be one way to do it, is just to use the heat stored up in, uh, in rocks and differentiate it with um, evaporative cooling on the bottom side of it. Anyway, that was just another uh, thought about this use of a Stirling engine to convert uh, solar energy into uh, electricity. Thanks for watching.